What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another highly combustible reaction. Which I've been into the next one on the Ali Walker journey. I made a song in 10 minutes, one hour, and 100 hours. No idea where we're going with it, but you know it's going to be big. Everything Alan Walker is huge. Definitely going to show him all the love in the world. The mass of wizard, a literal wizard. That's the only way to explain the magic that is his music and his following. Let's see what we got. No Corporal Sons has challenged me to create a song. I have 10 minutes for the first version, one hour for the second, and 100 hours for the final one. But... New message from Billy. But, There's a catch. So here's the thing, Alan. You have to make it sound like one of your old NCS songs. See you in 100 hours. The rules are simple. I have to make it sound like my old tracks from NCS. To ensure that each song follows a similar direction, I've decided to use the same bass melody for all three versions. And the melody I've chosen is this one. Right. And rule number three is when the time is up, I have to bounce the track no matter how far I've come. To put even more pressure on myself, I've decided to invite the entire disco community for a listening party where we will check out the final result of the song. So, the challenge starts right about now. 10 minutes on the clock, and while I'm already sweating, the big question is, where do I start? I always start off with the piano. For example, in this case, I have the chords already. The chords go all over the place. Like we have so many like chord changes and all that. And I think it's really cool melody that we can create into something like very iconic. Because what I want to do with when I make an instrumental song is to make it feel like you're telling a story, but there's no lyrics, and it's just the melody that tells you the story. So I came up with this. Oh Lord, I have so little time. Uh, 10 minutes to create a song. You think you could do it? Not a chance over here. Not a single little tiny chance whatsoever. Let's see what we can do with this. <sighs> I'm not like my house is sweaty. I'm stressing. <laughs> Three Usually, when I want to just have a quick layer for our bass, I always use Nexus, and there's one sound in particular that I always like. Just add a EQ and then it should sound a little like this. One minute. Okay, so let's just quickly find some leads and then wrap it up for now. Yeah, I like that. So let's just bounce this out. Okay, Dreamer 10 men. Whew. That was stressful. All right, 10 minutes done. Let's go. It's not like a world-class product, but at least we have an idea. Let's check out the 10. It's definitely a world-class product in my mind. This damn melody takes you somewhere. And drop. Boom. Could be cool. The 10 minute challenge was really fun, and there's a lot of elements I believe that I can take onward to the one hour challenge. The one hour is a long time, but it's not really, uh, especially if you're under pressure. I've never really like tried to challenge myself in the same way of like giving myself 10 minutes to just put together something. Because we already have the base from the first 10 minutes that we did. Uh, so find the kicks, percussions, hi-hats, and we make it sound as powerful as we can in just 60 minutes. Oh, 
Uh, I've just found some loops that fit really, really well uh, with the track. The reason why I'm using loops is because clearly like, uh, we're on a 60 minute challenge, so I'm not gonna spend time like nitpicking and manufacturing like the samples. Let's see. So it doesn't really sound much more like a clap anymore. It just sounds like it's more for a snare hit in a way. But what I tend to do in a lot of the songs that I work on is to have the pluck evolve into a lead, which just makes it sound bigger and stronger. Very soft and subtle. And then we have it sound like this in a drop. Another lead that I also added was the classic Nexus Square Aid 1 that I've been using in a lot of songs and especially in my early days back in 2014. I, I really liked the, the sound of the Square Aid 1. And it works really well when you layer it with a bunch of other leads. Now, what I've been looking at lastly is the FX stacks, like sweeps, sweeps ups, whatever, like impacts. Things yeah, like that could fill the atmosphere right in the song. Now. It's kind of like a detail you wouldn't really pay attention to, but it's usually just to fill maybe the empty room that's there. Okay, so we're closing up to almost being done here. I spent the last 10 seconds on exporting this. Let's go. Time is up. <laughs> this is awesome. I got so much more time to do a deep dive into all the leads. But at the same time, you're under a constant time pressure. So you just push forward and try to make the best uh, that you can of it. Let's check out the one hour track. Oh, uh, but wait, uh, let's bring in Sander first. But I want to listen to the one hour. Sander! Mm -hmm. Here he is. All right. You ready? I'm ready. I heard rumors it was going to be like old style, but it was like you've done a twist on the old style. I like it. <laughs> crazy. Boom. And now it's onto crazy. the last it's and final challenge. Insane. 100 hours. That should be enough to create something epic. So the listening party has been announced on Discord and uh, oof, I think people are really excited. If you are not already a member of the Discord, just click the link in the description. You will become a member of the community any day, anytime. The listening party will be taking place in approximately 100 hours from now. So let's get working. To be completely honest, I don't think I would need 100 hours. I mean, I could probably finish this track already today and just spend the rest of the time gaming. No, I'm just kidding. But uh, I think like the time that we have uh, is essentially really important. And uh, I think we have such a strong starting point just, and I think we can make this track tunings. even stronger. So let's dive into it. With Sir Dad work. 100 hours is roughly four full days. That is a lot more time than I've had previously. The good thing about having multiple days is that you can let your ears rest. In that way, you can come in the next day with a fresh view on what you've made. That didn't sound uh, anywhere near as bad as what I was expecting. Oh, I don't know, I don't really think I expected anything really bad either. It's day three of the challenge and uh, today I'm doing a late night session to work on the verses and uh, see if I can do something more uh, with a second drop. To be fair, I felt like close to being done even before day three, but there's always more details, more stuff you can add to a track. That's why we're here. We're gonna see if we can do more and see if we can, uh, can finish it either today or tomorrow. It could have been done on day one. Ooh. This is really starting to come together right now. I am actually beyond excited to show you guys this. But the fun stopped as soon as I came to realize it was actually less than 15 hours left. 
All right, guys, it's day four, and I just got this message from my Discord moderator. Yo, Ellen, the Discord party is already filling up. Wow. See you in a bit. We are closing up to the final hour and very happy and very satisfied with how this track sounds. It really reflects the old Alan Walker sound that people, fans, have been asking for for years. To be fair, like I love making this uh, sound. I've really missed doing so. My wish is to keep on doing this, keep on delivering tracks like this. And I think it's been really fun to do a challenge like this. 100 hours is finally coming to an end. It's been a, quite a run, uh, but I'm super excited about this and I'm super happy about the result. I really genuinely hope that you will love this song as much as I do, because this one has been made for you guys. So yeah, now it's time for the Discord listening party. We definitely saw the Discord listening party video. If you guys enjoyed seeing the pre, how it all came together, definitely get over show Alan Walker, all the love in the world. Smash the like button if you liked it, the dislike button, but I won't believe you. Tell the next one, am I the combustible? You guys be happy, healthy, safe, but let me to the boot, the back, peace.